Hi everybody, Broken Ebs here, welcome to today's video. Today's video is a little bit of a tiny smidgen of Linux content for you. So we're now at the beginning of February 2024. MX Linux AHS, AHS edition was installed on this computer back in November 2023. So it's been three full months now on MX Linux without so much as a snag or a hiccup. It's been sublime and I can 100 heart percent heartily recommend it to anybody who's thinking of ditching windows and going over to linux it's a great base platform for you to install set up run play stream record videos on your games and that's pretty much all i'm doing at the minute i'm doing no virtual boxing i'm not looking at other linuxes i'm not faffing around i've installed my amex linux i've left it alone well kind of um, installed all my games and away you go so the only thing that I did do was in the last update uh, the ability was added to automatically update the kernel so I'm using the AHS edition so I decided to install the licorice kernel and the auto updates so all you need to do is install this one here and it will go ahead and install the licorice kernel for you and then it should automatically update it whenever there's a new release available. The only other issue, <coughs> excuse me, ongoing issue that I've had with the whole system is actually nothing to do with MX Linux. <coughs> excuse me. It's to do with Steam. Now, Steam, every time I started Steam, it would update every single game in my library. Well, as you can see, I've got a hell of a lot of them. This is installed games, that is. And if I went down to downloads, this would always be full every single time I started Steam and it was doing my head in. Because I thought the games don't get updated like that. So my best friend Google did a simple Google search. And actually what it is, is if you go to Steam and settings and go to downloads, scroll down to the bottom, I got enable shader pre-caching. And it's downloading updating and pre-caching all the shaders for every single game you've got simply turn that off and it resolves it the only things you'll ever see here are game updates and every time that steam starts you won't be burdened with 60 plus games all updating other than that uh, I've got nothing to report. Uh, I want to try and get my American Truck Simulator Challenge Kansas completed uh, because I am now running out of time, although I have got uh, tomorrow. So, uh, we're currently on Saturday the 3rd, the 4th, and it finishes on Monday. So, I've got today and tomorrow to get the American Truck Challenge uh, completed. Uh, and if I have a look quickly at World of Trucks... Uh, world of chucks you'll see that it has added the uh christmas event so if we go to my page uh sign in there we go uh and you'll see there we go so it's added the christmas winterland and the christmas reflections awards uh achievements the last one that I want to add is this one here, Cruising Kansas. Uh, I want that one add in. I've still got these, but these are all still doable. So as far as I'm aware, to date, I've got uh, every single achievement. There's no achievement that I can't get that's seasonal or event based. Uh, and I've got a job on and I've got six hours 24 left to complete it. Nice. So, yeah, that's all going really f just mind-blowingly good. So I'm very, very happy on Amex Linux. We're on it for the whole of 2024. I can see, even at this early stage, this becoming my simple daily driver. Uh, my Windows gaming PC is sat there with Windows 11 and it hasn't been switched on since November which I think is great testament. So I've kind of got it there as a backup PC should anything happen to this old 25 quid PC, which I bought off of eBay. 
Uh, what else do I need to tell you? Anything else exciting happening? Not really. That's about it. Hope you're all safe and well. Hope you're all loving what you're doing. <clears throat> I'll try and get a little bit more active on the Discord, but it's very difficult to bash a load of content out and be active, blah, 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 etc. Um, in the next video, I'll be doing a look at my Star Wars The Old Republic account because quite a few of you have requested that, so thank you very much. Please keep requesting videos and content that you'd like to see. It's very much appreciated, and I'll do my best to get them made and get them out for you. Look after yourselves. Have a wonderful weekend. Much, much love to each and every one of you. As always, thank you so much to each and every one of you for your continued support. Much, much love. Stay safe, and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers, everybody.